I've been playing King's Vein because you have no time to game. King's Vein is the latest title from developer Rad Codex of Voidspire Tactics and Horizons Gate fame. I've briefly done a video on Voidspire, you can check that out if you want. King's Vein came out Jan 2024 for PC and took me roughly 20 hours to finish. The once thriving city of King's Vein has fallen silent. No communication reaches its walls and darkness envelops its streets. As the Whisper Slayer, your mission is clear. Uncover the city's fate and eradicate any evil that lurks within. Accompanied by your loyal wyvern and a few steadfast companions, you embark on a perilous journey, one which might open your eyes to a few hidden truths. The story is actually pretty fun. The companions even have solid reasons for being with you and get a bit of backstory themselves. And King's Vein is a weird land. It's very, very different to your traditional fantasy world which makes it all the more interesting to explore and learn about. And hey, you're not playing humans, which is always interesting. The gameplay, the first thing you do is obviously create your character. Customise your appearance, choose from distinct classes, um, and you even get to select which wyvern type you want and their colour. You can also adjust your companions once you get them as well. So you can get quite a diverse party of adventurers. The class system is similar to previous entries in that you gain XP for your main class that you've got equipped. And as you do, you unlock new skills by spending that XP um, or upgrading current skills to make them stronger, obviously. But following the theme of King's Vein, the classes are a little different from previous Rad Codex games. And even your Wyvern body has his own unique setup. So it's it's that con that continues that continuous uh, continues that theme that's throughout King's Vein of it's a bit different. So feel free to like dig in and explore these classes because they're not your usual types. King's Vein excels in its combat mechanics. It's a classic like turn-based tactic style. Um, it has a speed-based turn order, and each unit has limited actions and movement points per round. You need to strategize wisely, whether it's attacking foes, casting spells, or using items. But the twist is, those actions extend beyond just doing damage. Um, and even just even beyond combat. Abilities can be employed during exploration, like blurring the line between battle and the world around you. And you can literally start combat by using your abilities on enemies <laughs> before they even know you're there. Um... You'll often be outnumbered and outmatched, so you'll need to use the tactical advantages you can get. So, in King's Vein, even more than you did with Void Spire or Alvora Tactics, another Rad Codex title that I played but not finished yet. This is, like we said, the spells don't just do damage, they have a lot of other effects. And these are push, pulls, ice on the floor, setting fire to things all sorts so you'll be throwing enemies off ledges throwing them into spikes igniting the ground or setting off explosions like explosive items um using ice and fire to create bottlenecks basically the environment also plays like a crucial role and can massively increase the damage you cause if you use it correctly and stop you getting surrounded <laughs> as i said exploration isn't as simple as just walking around there's a lot of secret treasures everywhere, and the map is massively interconnected. You can almost say it's the Dark Souls of the Tactics world. On top of this, with your character's abilities, you're able to interact with the map in unique ways. There's a ton of different ways to actually proceed because of this. So if you get like teleport spells and all that sort of stuff, you can get around in a different way than you might normally have been able to. Anyway, we usually jump into Metacritic at this point, but... As we often see the tactic genre, especially from indie titles, mainstream media fails us once again. But on Steam itself, it's sitting at very positive, which is worth it. So, in conclusion, King's Vein wields a compelling tapestry of a turn-based combat and exploration. Its challenging battles, environmental nuances, 
and mysterious narrative keep players engaged. If you're a fan of tactics RPGs and crave a world team with secrets, King's Vein deserves a spot on your gaming radar. And my final rating is give it a go.